The most common cause of neck pain is muscle strain and sprain. It is the result of overuse and repetitive neck motions. For instance, the computer slouch, sleeping in awkward positions or lifting heavy objects incorrectly. The underlying mechanism is muscle damage. When a muscle is harmed, it involuntarily contracts to protect itself, leading to what is known as a spasm. This spasm can stress the small joints in the spine, causing inflammation and pain, or exert pressure on nerves, which may result in radiating pain to the arm, tingling, or numbness. Typically, pain is localized to one side of the neck. Turning the head in any direction can be painful, and looking up or down may be challenging. The pain usually peaks on the first or second day and then gradually subsides over time, with significant improvement often seen within the first week. In such cases, the individual might recall a recent event that triggered the onset of pain. The best treatment for neck pain arising from strain and sprain includes non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, such as ibuprofen or naproxen. For individuals with a risk of bleeding, such as those with gastrointestinal problems, acetaminophen is recommended. Topical creams, especially diclofenac and ibuprofen, as well as capsaicin-containing creams, are effective for pain relief. The second most common cause of neck pain is the wear and tear of bones and joints, known as osteoarthritis, also known as cervical spondylosis. This condition arises as the discs between vertebrae degrade over time due to aging, and vertebral bone growths that aim to stabilize the spine but may further damage surrounding nerves and cause symptoms. This pathological growth of the bone is called bone spurs or osteophytes. Cervical osteoarthritis leads to muscle stiffness, pain, and sometimes nerve compression, with symptoms radiating to the shoulder and arm. This condition typically manifests after age 40, and factors such as heavy lifting, trauma, and genetics can accelerate its progression. Patients often describe this as chronic neck pain that worsens with movement, accompanied by a grinding or popping sensation when moving their neck. Nerve compression can lead to tingling, numbness, or weakness in the arms and hands. For diagnosis is facilitated through X-rays, MRI, and CT scans, which can reveal the degradation of vertebral discs and the presence of bone spurs, osteophytes, on the vertebrae. Exercise plays a crucial role in managing cervical spondylosis. In the management of neck pain, medications such as ibuprofen and naproxen serve as primary options. In more severe cases, muscle relaxants like cyclobenzaprine and tizanidine are utilized, typically administered orally. From supplements which can help joints can be considered omega-3 fatty acids, known for their anti-inflammatory effects. Glucosamine and chondroitin are often utilized for joint health and may aid in cartilage repair. Vitamin D and calcium supplements are also recommended in many cases to support bone health. Topical treatment also effective in many cases. Capsaicin cream, menthol or camphor creams provide temporary pain relief. Topical applications of diclofenac, ketoprofen, and ibuprofen are also viable options due to their localized anti-inflammatory actions. Another common cause of neck pain is a herniated intervertebral disc, leading to cervical radiculopathy. This condition occurs when the intervertebral disc's material leaks out, compressing nerve roots, typically due to age-related degradation or trauma. Symptoms include sharp or burning pain, radiating tingling sensations to the arm, shoulder, or hand, and potentially muscle weakness affecting grip strength. Treatment focuses on physical therapy to strengthen neck muscles, improve posture, and increase flexibility, thereby reducing nerve root compression. For pain, same methods are used as above-mentioned cases. But here sometimes oral corticosteroids are used such as prednisone and methylprednisone, but only for short period of time because of their side effects. Other potential causes of neck pain encompass infections like pharyngitis, physical injuries such as whiplash from rear-end car collisions, rheumatoid arthritis which also affects other joints, 
spinal stenosis leading to spinal canal narrowing, and in rare cases, meningitis or tumors.